today I am bringing up three altcoins that have yet to really see a significant pump and price appreciation. So make sure you stay tuned. Ah. Dingles, good morning. I hope you're having a fantastic morning. It is Friday and we're talking about crypto so you really cannot ask for much more than that but you can because today i am bringing up three altcoins that have yet to really see a significant pump and price appreciation so make sure you stay tuned to our DeFi, and one is kind of a position and a play on nft so make sure you stay tuned for those but let's just jump right into it so big dog says hey looking for DeFi that's not up five thousand percent yet and that's why i'm bringing up these tokens later because they have yet to see the price appreciation that the wider market has so make sure you stay tuned and now let's let's read what king colby has to say because back in this bear market of 2018 19 and 20 early 20 uh, in March 2020 was tough guys I almost I cried a little bit then but anyways we powered through and there was a light at the end of the tunnel billionaires are now using DeFi and trading NFTs with rappers publicly traded companies are hedging inflation by holding Bitcoin the richest man in the world is pumping shit coins it is what I always dreamt it could be holy cow guys we are we are here even though i think we are far from it because i'm going to point you out something here in a second i think bitcoin there will be marginal returns on bitcoin here from here out i mean marginal returns in the sense that it won't go up a thousand percent right it might it probably will be a good like 10 to 15 percent a year or something to that extent once it gets above like five six seven trillion dollar market cap right so Keep, just know that but the real growth will be in DeFi and will be in nfts because bitcoin has roughly the same amount of users as the internet had in 1997 even though i think bitcoin is still a very good investment like i just stated i think DeFi and positioning yourself well in DeFi and holding long term especially in like i say a DeFi index or or just uh I mean, a DeFi index is probably the easiest way to do it. Obviously, you could pick individual DeFi stocks. A lot of them are very overpriced. It, yeah, a lot of them are very overpriced. But also, non-fungible tokens, guys. Non-fungible tokens will definitely be a huge part in the blockchain world. I mean, a lot of people see these art and see these non-fungible tokens and say there's no utility for it and there's no there's no use for it why do i need an nft and they always said that about bitcoin about ethereum about DeFi, etc etc that's how it starts and then utility builds around non-fungible tokens utility builds around DeFi and ethereum and utility builds around bitcoin right innovation will be built around non-fungible tokens point blank period bet on it and that's what i'm doing and this project that i'm about to show you is kind of a play on it as well so make sure you stay tuned and now let's check out bitcoin's price action let's refresh we're sitting at 36.7 and consolidating much i i honestly would not mind us consolidating for another month and a half two months I really don't care how long we consolidate for it really does not matter to me the longer the better the longer we consolidate and the slower we go up in price the more sustainable it is the faster we go up the less sustainable it is I say that a lot because it's very important the slower we go up the better in my opinion now let's check out ethereum's price action because I mean we're at all-time highs we are in price discovery mode I mean, we found resistance around $1,700, guys. First time ever saying that. We were just less than, I, I think, 10 months ago now. We were at $90, and now we're at $1,700. Absolutely insane. Uh, we might bend over and break that support at $1,575. But at the end of the day, I don't know what's going to happen and I really don't care because I all I know is over time the price will go up because this is an innovative space and everything is working towards 
creating value and that's all you need to know and ethereum there's a lot of exciting news coinbase ipo uh eip 1559 including uh coinbase staking and exchange staking for ethereum a lot of i mean this year is going to be a very exciting year for ethereum for sure now let's talk about my first token and what happened with urine finance today urine have finance had an exploit v1 y die vault has suffered an exploit the exploit has been mitigated full report to follow and this is why i bring up this next token and that is cover holy cow guys 676 holy smoke so literally because of this exploit covers price has significantly gone up look at this holy cow 674 that's amazing guys that's awesome to see i i was going to bring this up either way today because i thought it was extremely under val, undervalued because their partnership with yearn and their in, implementations with yearn finances ui and just a overall protocol but also nexus mutual is a comparable protocol that has a 400 million dollar market cap and cover is sitting here at 38 million that's i mean cover and nexus mutual are the main two insurance protocols in DeFi, and everyone that uses nexus mutual usually has an option for cover as well i mean cover is going to be right next to it they're integrated with they have huge partners huge developers good stuff except they had to exploit early on which hurt a lot of people and i understand they're they're hesitant to get back in for sure alan follow him if you don't a claim has been filed for iron cover i mean iron finance which is urine finance on uh, cover protocol a snapshot for cover token holders to vote on the validity of this claim has been posted at the moment there is total of 570,000 die of coverage circulating so there you go i'm going to be doing another cover protocol video here shortly because there's a lot of new stuff happening with cover protocol and now let's go into my next pick and this is a good pick for like positioning yourself in the nft space because it will only grow and flow and dapper labs is the one that is positioning themselves to to in an advantageous position to take advantage of the non-fungible token market they if you use an nba top shot you had to set up a dap, dapper wallet as well as use a flow blockchain it's it's awesome what they're doing just seven days on the open market i guess and i mean if nba top shots the amount of success nba top shot saw and how quickly it got adopted i sports leagues will be coming out of the yin yang to get on flow and utilize the same do the same thing that nba top shot did so that's going to be exciting and i'm almost certain that will happen in the near future because of the success that nba top shot has seen it's just incredible here's the co-founder raham um go check him out apparently he's doing doctor dr seuss <laughs> uh, non-fungible tokens which and collectibles on flow which is kind of cool and now for some creator tokens because i think this is another kind of uh thing to bring up and another fad that's going to happen and that's if you don't know terry cruz i mean he's a freaking huge actor right he's a huge actor he does the old spice commercials where he spikes his boobs and they go bouncing up and down right and i mean he's huge he's dropping a creator token on rally which uh is a token and a pr protocol as well you can check them out but it's pretty awesome guys and this is just the first domino to fall and it's going to be very interesting to see influencers gravitate and try to make their own token right so that's going to be exciting and power pool is my last and final one and actually this has been pumping so much today guys which is unfortunate i mean literally i was just looking at this earlier today to bring this up and it was around like 285 290 and now it's already at 325 guys what the frick guys dang but anyways power pool i like one thing specifically about power pool it's indices protocol a lot of DeFi indexes but they also have an x die bridge so you can send tokens over this bridge and 
you will be able to put on the XDyne network, right? So that's why CVP is a, a good governance token to hold because of that XDyne bridge. And if XDyne sees more adoption, this bridge will see more usage. And that's what you wanna see. And XDyne is just seeing more adoption because of gas fees, right? And lastly, let's listen to Ray Lewis, one of my favorite football players ever. Very motivational, very, very good individual to listen to for sure. And let's listen to what he has to say here. You know, I always say, you show me your crowd, I'll show you your future. It's, it's simple, right? There's three type of people you need in your life. You need the inspired, the excited, and the grateful. So now you sit here and tell me you don't know what to do. You know what to do. But the people you're around ain't doing what you're supposed to be doing. I'm begging you, man. I'm begging you from a man's for me. Let go. Let go. Let go of these people who you know aren't for you. You know, I always say. I mean, that's so true. You are who you surround yourself with. And let me just say this right now. I'm so impressed with the Dingle community. We are filled with very intelligent people, been around crypto for a while with mixed in newbies, but that's okay because we were all start as newbies and just very intrigued with blockchain. And that's how I fell in love with the crypto community is just simply that the crypto community. I share a lot of the same values with the crypto community. And to be honest, the people in crypto are arguably the smartest people in the world. Arguably, I mean, Elon Musk is in crypto. I mean, <laughs> the people in crypto are extremely intelligent. Developers are extremely intelligent and talented and skillful and, skillful and insightful. And it's just amazing the quality of the individual in the crypto space, guys. Awesome stuff. I, I love it all. It's awesome. And if you wanna join the Dingo community, go ahead and subscribe and like because we are awesome community for sure and discord and telegram is an active telegram check it out we talk all the time in there and then follow my twitter and my dingle twitter i appreciate each and every one of you i hope you have a fantastic day fantastic weekend and peace out until next time dingoes peace out